Hello, my brothers and sisters. This is your sister, Queen Divine. Today, I have a very beautiful message for every pair African parents who lives overseas. I'm going to talk about child's benefits. What does child's benefit? Uh, child benefit is some money that is given to parents to cope in bringing up their children. And this money is given to them monthly in form of a salary so that they can also have to the uh, the ones they make in the monthly uh, job uh, so that they would not uh, lack enough money to take care of those kids and the government do this to everybody being you they are citizens being you from anywhere all over the world as far as you are there in their country and you are having your case, the government never denies this uh, helping hand to every parents in their countries. And this is a very wonderful thing. And I thank the government also for doing this help and uh, helping our par uh, many of those parents uh, uh, with this uh, child's benefits. But one thing that makes me that made me to 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 make this uh, video clip is because of so many so many of our African parents, uh, the the some of them they misuse this money, and uh, they don't even use this money for the kids. Child's benefit is not for you as parents to misuse. This money are given to you by the government. To take good care of your children not for you to consume anyhow when you have uh this monthly money coming into your accounts because the money goes to the uh, the, women, the mothers it goes directly to the mother's account they don't give put this uh, child benefit they don't give it to their uh, fathers they give this money and uh, they pay this money into the women's account and later you see some of these are african parents they now take this money they misuse it they use it on themselves they don't even use it for these kids this is very very wrong and as you guys are doing those things you think the government doesn't know the government is not they are not fools they know what you're doing they know how you're making your movement so i'm trying to educate many of my african uh, parents that when you have your child's benefit you should try to open an account for them for these kids you open an account for them. Each month when the, the money comes in, you have to put in their money into the account. You can take up from it a little bit. You can take from it to buy their, their, their winter clothes, to buy their summer clothes, to buy good shoes for them. Not going to uh, characters to pick uh, used clothes that other kids has used from other families. You, you, you start wearing them, or use, uh, use clothes, use shoes, everything you pick for them, uh, uh, things that have been used before. This is very, very wrong. You can't start buying used clothes for your children. They have a lot of bacteria inside it. There are a lot of stores you can go to where you buy, you can buy new clothes, not even too expensive. Every clothes that, that are sold in overseas for children are of good qualities. Even if the money is not that big, it is not so expensive. Every clothes for children, are, they, they use the best qualities, 100% good qualities to make their clothes, to, to sew their clothes. So I find it so wrong of many of you guys, some of them to the extent they would divorce their, 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 their wife or their wives will also divorce their husbands because of child's benefits. So many of our Africans here who lives in some of, uh, some of these countries that gives uh, child benefit, they now became so lazy. Some of them doesn't even want to go to work. They now start having kids to, to start collecting money from the government, which is wrong. As men, you should work. As women, you should also work. You shouldn't start having kids because you want to have uh, start collecting free money from the government and this money you don't even use it well for those kids. This is very very wrong. Many of our people they do these things every time to the extent child's benefits has made a lot of them to be separated 
and now they no longer uh they don't they no longer uh stay together because of shy's benefit when the monthly uh money comes in they will start fighting they will not start fighting you have to give me this yeah, I am the one that's supposed to have this money. I am the one that's supposed to do this. But that, those monies are not for you. You should also know that here in the Western world, that when the, when a child gets to a certain age, uh, like 18 years old, they don't live, many of them now wants to live alone. So what? Where, where are you going to get the money that you will also use in getting them a very nice apartment? They will not have, start when they are 18 or 17, 18, they will not start going to uh, driving schools. They want to learn how to drive. Where are you going to get the money to pay their, for their driving licenses? Where are you get, going to get the money to buy them a car? So these are, some of them will also want to go about to have their own business. Some of them will tell you that they are not doing well in school. They want to have their own personal business. As parents, where will you get this money to use for these uh, children? So you should start putting money into your kids account so that when the time comes for them you cannot give them the money to start using to make to start to start their lives this is very that's the way it should be if the government we are not giving you money to, to monthly money for your child for your children can't you as parents work to take good care of your kids this is always has always been my questions. If the government is not giving you a, a child benefit, can't you as parents train your kids up? In Africa, we don't have child benefit from anybody, from any government, from the society. Our parents did these things for us. They trained us wholeheartedly. They did their training on us personally, without the help from anybody, without the help from the government. And our parents, Back home, they are not lazy. They were it lazy. They put their hour, our mamas, they put their hour on the bed. They work 24 hours of the day to make sure they put food on the, on the table for us. They make sure they, they, they did everything to make their children okay. But now, there's so many youths who came to overseas, in the, to the Western world, they now make that as an opportunity to start collecting money, from the government without even thinking about their life how can a big huge man be living in his house 24 hours of the day watching televisions playing uh, video games or uh, uh, chatting every time on the internet without doing a job without, without going to uh, a daily office to work and take care of his family so many men out there from africa who are getting who are getting a uh, child support many of them don't go to work there you still see a lot of good intelligent men responsible men even if they are getting child support they don't have time for that money they take good care of their children they do everything they still work 24 hours of the day i give kudos to such men who are in europe who are getting child support and they are still spending their money as parents to take good care of their children and they don't care about their, this child support they use they work 24 hours of the day to feed their family to take care of their wives and children and i also give kudos to every woman out there in europe though they are having child support they still work to take good care of their children kudos to those great parents so I'm now telling, using this uh, opportunity to tell those lazy men and women out there who always love collecting their children's so child support and always goes to Caritas to pick one one cent uh, clothes, use, already used clothes on their children. They cannot even go to the stores, to the boutiques to buy new clothes for their children to buy good uh, quality uh, shoes for their children all they do is to start walking around characters where people will start giving their free used clothes this is very very bad so when later the government now sees your kids because you're not taking good care of them then you now start saying the government sees my children the government is not good hello you are the one who is not good you are the one 
who doesn't know how to be a good parent? How can you go to a shop, a baby you just had, maybe a month old baby, even a day old baby, your rooms are filled up already with uh, uh, already used clothes or cricker. What are you doing with those things? Ha, this is heartbreaking. This is so, so unbelievable. Unglaublish. This is unglaublish. Unbelievable. It's first day niche. I don't understand what's wrong with some people. So my brothers and sisters, you should from now, if you hear this message, always keep your children's child's benefits, open an account for them and start saving their, for their future instead of you start fighting and divorcing yourself because of child's benefits. Or some of them will start going out, buying, smoking, buying cigarette, smoking, 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 smoking. They will not even spend a dime on their kids. The kids that the money belongs to, they will never use the money on those kids. This is very, very wrong. So as parents, you have to put your best. You have to work, especially those men who love staying at home and waiting for their for the monthly uh, child benefits that is coming from the from the government and that's what it depends on they don't want to work this is bad and these are some of some of the things that makes the government make it quickly for them they just seek your skills from you because they know what you are doing so i just felt i have to give this message to my African brothers and sisters, parents, that you guys should turn a new leaf and start to behave well and use this child's benefits money very good for your children. Use the plan, use the plan with this money and take good care of them and stop buying used clothes for your babies because it's not good. You can buy used clothes. Okay, you are, you are, you are, you are okay. It's no problem. But when it comes to babies, to your kids, they are too small to start wearing uh, already used clothes from others. That's some people are just fond of buying new old, old uh, used clothes for their children. They want to buy a pant, they will go to the to the okrika, they will go to the to the to the characters to pick panties, everything. They, they don't buy new things, and the, the government are giving them their best, are giving them money. To buy good things for these children to even cook good food for them they can't do that this is so hard beating so you guys i had made this uh, video purposely for you people to to listen to and now to start doing good things with the money that are given to your kids thank you very much i hope you uh, guys have been able to learn one or two things from my message God bless you all. Please, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I am your sister, Queen Divine. Bye.